Hello, you're back to FTL March Showcase. We're still flying the Arrow by Vectuality. Uh, playing in Project Coalition. Let's keep going. Uh, four lasers. What crew does he have? There's an NG. Okay. Now we know. And now we're just power. Um, let's... We'll have to wait. I'll wait for the first shot and see how things go. Yes, it is Project Coalition. Dooge. Um, which is no longer available on the forums. So, it's a bit of a unique thing I have here. I took the missile launcher off, that's something. I'm gonna hack, because we have plenty of drone parts. Yeah, it's no longer available because the whole mod got a little bit out of hand and the person, or one of the two persons that originally started it, is now trying to set things right and in the time being he pulled the mod from the forums. Uh, could we do this while turning off? Maybe. Oh, I can't. Oh, I can it's shields that I need to turn off. Come on, come on. Okay. Google is possible, but it's not going to be easy. Actually, here we go. Dual stunner. I'm not in this disable system. Yeah, we know that. Three power, two shots. One eye on damage. Hmm. Does stun stack or does it reset? Don't want to go through the pulsar. I guess we'll go this way then. Merchant. All right. Um, only one shop here, huh? Hmm. A little sooner than I would want to go to the store, but. I would like that teleporter though. Is it worth selling LRS over to get a teleporter now? I think so, because we're starting to lag behind. Is there any way I can come back here, though? Yeah, there's something here, but we don't know. Alright. Hopefully we find something here. And we can go back for a teleporter. Yeah, okay. Final system slot. <laughs> Wait, can we buy everything? Yeah, this is fine, this is fine, this is fine, okay. It's worth checking, you know.
Okay, teleporter duty. That's going to be you and you for now, I guess. Jeez, we'll be upgrading sensors soon as well. Hmm? Ah, okay, I gotcha. What was the quest again? Why am I so terrible at remembering what we were doing? Okay, they're gonna board us as well. Let's quickly have a check here. Oh, no, there's two of them, there's two of them. Uh, weapons are free to board. doing this because it also gives us a little bit longer of a time for these guys to go bash on that that and gets our weapon shots through I guess oh, wow nice sink you got there it would be a shame if it all went to waste oh they they went around look at that Okay, so that's going to be a no on coming back. Oh, there's not even a door here. Ugh, whatever. beam somewhat standard beam up that starts fires okay crystal burst mark one modified version of the burst mk1 that was designed for lead ships locks down rooms don't get me wrong torch beam sounds good but keep in mind we only have two weapon slots Try to go for like <clears throat> maximum lockdown. Just lock down so many ships that the enemy just can't get anywhere anymore. But uh, I'm gonna get this in preparation of it replacing the beam, I think. Because once we start getting two shielded ships, it's gonna become pretty annoying uh, getting through without using hacking nothing wrong with using hacking but if you have to use it on every fight then we're going to run out of drone parts really soon And did I just commit to a rebel dive? I could use the mantis. Yes! Nice. Get back to there. Get back to there. Come along with me. Anybody in weapons? Think about the end of the song. That's apparently the way to get rid of uh, earworms like that.
That was one weird series though, wasn't it? Wasn't that the end credits though? blame you for that and yeah we're diving even though there is no rebel fleet in this because they forgot to put it in so rebel dives really aren't a problem <laughs> carpet lights up with warning signals be targeted by nearby ship blah 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 prepare for a fight yep prepare for a fight option is right there Alanius though um is that going to be a problem? Yeah, because he's trying to board with him. Um, doesn't matter, right? We have to get in there anyway. Uh, you're just going to leave the weapons room? Um, and board me with the NG instead? Um, sure. Also, I'm going to hack shields because they got this thing. It's gonna be hard enough as this to get through without that. Something like that, I guess. But they never really implemented that. So rather than keeping the original Rebel Fleet, they just scrapped that and forgot to put in something else. Brilliant idea, mind you, but... You know. This is not ideal because this doesn't pierce shields. Uh, well, this one pierces one shield, this one doesn't. So basically we only have three shots if shields aren't completely down. So there shouldn't be anything here. Abandoned already, yeah. It's really well made and stuff, but why is there no event here? I mean, granted, it's still annoying because, you know, every beacon I take over means there's nothing there, but you can easily do like three extra jump if it means quote unquote diving once now. No real risk in it. Crystal Sector. Shit, what if calling this guy a ruin would have done anything? Nope. Sector is home to the crystalline race. So crystals, enemy crystals do use their lockdown ability. Or no 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 I'm 
assuming that's just a lockdown bomb, so I'm willing to take that one. Dooge. Oh, that's another bomb. Okay. Yeah, going for teleporter was a good idea, I think. Mind control would be up next, but we can't get it in the crystal sector because limit time offer doesn't work in them. Which was done deliberately, if I recall correctly. Yeah, usually it is. Unless you're like... Your weapon setup is so good that you don't have the time to board. We're going to need a shield hack over here, methinks. Actually, why don't you do... No, just fire both on there. I thought to re-block down this room so we could bash on the shields a bit longer, but... Then again, it wouldn't mean... Yeah, their weapons are too dangerous to keep online, I think. lockdown not smart in using it but they do use it I'm not locked in here with you you're locked in here with me maybe he just wanted to be a hero and go like look I can beat a crystal animatis on my own and then he died oh painful horrible death It happens. <laughs> what is... Oh, yeah. He should be an NG, right? For maximum... Irony. Okay, we'll go, we'll go to the store. Let's know what we're looking for. Again, mind control will be great, but we already have eight systems, so we need to get it from limit time offer. Limit time offer does not work in the crystal sector. Yo, dude, that's a lot of dudes. Um, we do need to be careful here. Um, lockdowns here could be a problem. So I'm going to try to swap out ahead of time. Yeah. 
So the only thing we would be on the lookout for would be augments and maybe a weapon. Now, Project Coalition has a ton of crazy overpowered weapons, so... You flack. Um, flak is good. So is a reloader. Just look at that. Cool, I'm team up. Shots improved by 40%. Which in vanilla is just 10%. So I think I'm going to get the flak and the reloader. I'm probably... Hmm. I guess I'll sell you. It's slower charging. Yes, it has one shield pierce, but Flak is going to take care of that. And it can be shot down by drones as well, so yeah. Uh, drone parts looking fine. Yep, okay. Cool. Oh, look, it's another shop. <laughs> Shops are plenty, huh? The crystals quickly took to shopkeeping as soon as lockdown was lifted. Crystals fly plus plast, sure. Pass the screen as soon as you arrive. Check and scan. It looks like Crystalline Ship is engaged with a rebel. Um, I mean, technically the crystals are the a-holes here. What do you think, Styles? I've had like the most fun event at some point with saving rebels, and I don't know if it's this one. I don't think it is. But I'm gonna leave this one up to you. I'm kind of willing to attack the crystals myself, but I mean, in Project Coalition, it's the crystals, mantis, and slugs that are being. I don't know. So you want me to go after the crystals then? Unfortunately, I can't fight them both, but let's go after the crystals. Uh, oh, it's evacuation. It's not a fleet anymore. Okay, you move into a separate crystalline ship as soon as a rebel scans your ship. It takes the opportunity to jump. You have the sneaking suspicion they will inform the fleet of your position, but that's the least of your current concerns. Should have known, right? This is Project Coalition. After all, things are screwy. Yeah, now we know, right? Wow, 85% dodge missing twice in a row. Some things never change, huh? That's a missile too, I believe. Um, it's probably too late to hack it, because it's already charged. I really like how they hide missiles as crystal shards. People definitely aren't going to be annoyed by that. Spoiler, they will. I want to shoot at that, but I want to make sure that I actually get my crew with it. Cool. Uh, are we going to win this? We should. 
Okay, we only have 75% dodge now, so we should be fine. See? Check, I guess. FTL Crystal Event Age of Device this is Crystal Cruiser Crystal Events Crystal Sector Events whatever. Crystal Ship engaged with Rebel. Yeah, it's a vanilla event. Why would you ever f attack the crystals then? I suppose so. I mean, you do have the option to attack the peace convoy, so... Just FTL things. Well, you do get a reward for that, right? Whilst avoiding a fight. like we're missing a cloaking image as well here and a floor image and overlapping interiors man should have done this at the start of things makes sense i mean there's no anti-bomb drone she's not a shop enough already Grizzly ship scores direct hit and obliterates damage. Da, da, da. You're like these other aliens. You brought them here. With that, they turned their cannons on you. Yeah. Clearly, because your sector wasn't clearly marked on the sector map. You know. Not to mention that it's your people that are chasing me right now. But, you know. Right? Project Coalition! <laughs> Brings the can't hit the broadside of a barn to an entirely new level, though. <sighs> I should have. Fired first. Oh well. Did he now? Mm -hmm. 
I wonder what the benefit of a crystal missile would be. Eh, people say a lot of stuff, right? So far, so good. We're handling the two weapon slots quite well. I could probably think of a few things that are worse to say. That would probably lead to an instant demonetization, though. This beam weapon has been overloaded with so much energy that it no longer functions as it should. Are you seeing this? Like, look at this! That's five shots dealing one damage plus four system damage. So one shot deals five system damage. These two weapons are enough to win. Can I get both of them just for the frick of it? Actually, I only need this one because since it's a laser weapon that deals damage, it can also destroy shields. Like, if I got this, this, and this, it would be game over right now. Now we just have to wait a little bit longer. <laughs> I guess I'll keep the... I mean, the lockdown is still useful. Yeah, I think I'll get rid of the flak of all things. I mean, once I can get uh, both weapons online, that is. Um, I got a full flak now. I don't need flak too, right? No, I don't. Um. Alright, we found our Project Coalition special overpowered weapon for this run. Then again, we could still get a an ion beam of sorts. Yes, they exist in here as well. Wow, you're an alien that opened up the portal, aren't you? No, it was open when we got there. You busy? Can I ask you? Sure. One of us didn't know we made an alliance with the aliens. Uh, okay, I know in vanilla this makes all the sense. In Project Coalition, slightly less. Either the other guy has been living under a rock for a few years. Hey, maybe he yeah, has. I don't know how uh, crystals live. Is that a reference to something? Because I'm not getting it, if so. Eh, fuel's fine. Let's go rock controls, because I really don't want to deal with bland is boarding. It is level 1 mind control, at the very least. Probably. 
Especially if it's like an NG ship, you can just keep going round and round. Look at that 41% evasion. This is like what, like sector five? Six? That's a lot of evasion, dude. Up to a point where I'm not even gonna try to uh, fire a volley without hacking being active. Zero percent evasion, much better. Uh, I'm gonna let him break that. Might as well get some repair skill. Ordeal of midnight. Oh yeah, the one you kind of screwed up because you didn't know how elevators worked. Good stuff. Man, how long has it been since we've played that? <sighs> Was that a missile that fired? Yeah. It's gonna be called Lobotomy Institution. Where's my evasion? Ah, yes, it's completely gone. Hmm. I mean, the Corporation was a fun game. I have received spam. It's probably gonna be boring. Yep. Interesting. The whole thing was weird. Um, right. Intruders on board. Well, two can play that game. A lot of rug dudes on board, though. Uh, well, let's hop to it. They're not gonna kill themselves. Oh yeah, what was that on again? Didn't I have that thing? Like that weird bush that every so often just try to abduct one of your guys? Yeah. Preventing five people from getting nabbed in, to begin with. Whoops. Was not paying attention to that side of the screen. No, I'm pretty sure that would have just made me go nuts. I kept that guy. Of course the missile launcher just doesn't go down, because, you know, why would it?
Okay. Well, we got our piling back though, didn't we? It's not like shields were gonna do anything either. Right, we're gonna lose doors, I will accept that. Yeah, I had my own version of it, but uh, it wasn't as good as this, so. Welcome, Oreo Fish, by the way. Um, yeah, doors are just a goner. Uh, they're probably going to go back to piloting because they're jerks about it. Uh, but they're going to not be able to repair their stuff for a while, so we can... Oh, no, they're going to sensors. Cool. Thank you. keep my stream up because people can do stuff now on there and I'm not sure if it's gonna show up in restream chat Like the third bomb that goes to doors. No, it's second bomb. They destroy doors with their boarding crew. Um, all right, that's gonna do it for this episode. We'll be continuing on shortly, so don't go anywhere. But for now, thank you guys for watching. We're still in a series of free shows probably coming out more soon. See you guys on the next episode. Bye, everyone.